I don't really know what we're waiting for. We're going antelope hunting today. Dad and Tyler are running a little bit late. Looks to me like. It's still pretty dark out. But the time Tyler told me was 20 minutes ago. So. We're going to send them a little text message here. Check out these new lids. A new lid for Tyler. He's pretty excited for it. Just had it made the other day. That's a plane. Well, good morning. <laughs> nice to see you guys joined us. Whatever Brian said earlier, it was a lie. He was late, we've been waiting on him for about a half hour. He's just being a diva. seen two bucks so far haven't seen the gargantuan monsters that Brian claims he was chasing around here the other day he said they were like 90 inch ghosts just <laughs> walking everywhere you couldn't go anywhere without tripping over one literally tripping over I haven't seen any of those yet so he was either lying or he was in a different spot he might be holding out on me don't you think I'm gonna take you to my good spots I guess not I thought Thought we had a good relationship going, but I guess not. I love my brother, but it's a different level. We'll, we'll keep driving around here, see if we can pick something up and see if we can make a play on anything. These are the all elusive Nebraska Prairie Muscat. If you guys know what those are, comment in the comment below and we would like to know what they are also. We have no idea. Look like furry cows. We've never seen them before in my life. just got permission on this place and we drove like 20 yards and there's a goat so we're gonna get out we're gonna put a stock on it see if we can't get close enough we think it's gonna be a little far we got some bales here but it's gonna be interesting it's kind of windy right now so I'm not sure how, how exactly it's gonna work but we're gonna give it a shot walking away we were he was a little un, unsure about what was going on so it just didn't work out we'll keep going we got a goat right over here we're gonna go put a sneak on it we got corn here and he's probably 80 to 100 yards off the corn but we're gonna get up that get up the corn rows get uh, perpendicular with him and see what happens so these corn rows run parallel with him so
67 yards. Wind. It's, I don't know, 67 yards. If I could have got out of the corn, I would have had a perfect shot on it. Oh well, he's hanging out out there. If he gets far enough over there, maybe we'll go mess around with him from the other side of the corn. The advantage right now that we have is he's in between these two cornfields and we can use that to get somewhat close. It was perfect if you wouldn't have got out. Yeah. He had to hurt us or something. He had to hurt us. He heard something he didn't like. Yeah. Because he didn't just casually get up, like he got up like he heard something I thought. Kind of broke. How they move too fast towards the end. I should have known better. I did the same thing last week. Last time I was out here, move too fast. Okay, let's get going. Let's get out of here. So I realized as I was making that video that I forgot to do an outro. So this is what you guys are going to get. After we made that stock, we headed back to the pickup, drove around for a little bit, and then saw two bucks sitting about 700 yards off the road. And we grabbed the decoy, hoping that maybe they would have a reaction to it. And the reaction they had was they ran away. So after that, we headed back to the pickup, headed back to the house, and got some dinner, got some rest, and we're up the next morning going. So if you guys like this video, make sure you guys hit the like button, make sure you guys subscribe to our channel. And also check out our Instagram. We're at the Seasons Media. We also have our shop up and running and we've got some gear on there. We got some hats and some shirts. So you guys can go check that out and get some gear. And other than that, make sure you guys are following along as we go through this season. We're gonna be doing a lot of cool stuff and hopefully getting a lot of good footage for you guys. Catch you guys tomorrow.